Welcome everyone, this is Alex Burke from the Salem Museum and Historical Society, and for this week's installment of White Glove Wednesdays, we are here to look at this artifact right here. It measures about three feet tall by about two feet wide and five feet long, and it is made of solid copper. And no, for a couple children have asked, no, it's not a popcorn maker. This is a antique moonshine still from the 1920s. It was originally made in Hopkins Gap, Virginia, which is around the Harrisonburg area, by moonshiner Gilbert Morris. And Gilbert was making moonshine one day, when unsuspecting, he was being watched by revenue agent Jack Powell and his team. They were, they've been watching uh, Gilbert for a little while at this point, and they finally sprung their trap to arrest him. Morris, figuring out that he was going to get arrested, quickly fled the scene trying to escape from the revenue man, Jack Powell. But in the commotion of the escape, Jack Powell actually fired a shot off in the direction trying to stun Morris. But as legend has it, as Morris is diving into a bush, the bullet strikes him in the foot, and he realizes he's been shot. Making a no attempt to further escape, he quickly surrenders himself to the revenue man. But comes to find out the bullet, actually it's simply just lodged in his heel and he wasn't hurt at all. Jack Powell actually kept that bullet as a reminder of the occasion and kept it in his desk drawer for the remainder of his life. But this still, is, uh, still tells that story perfectly and how it came from. But that's going to be it for this week's installment of White Glove Wednesday, everyone. Thank you so much for checking it out. This is Alex Burke from the Salem Museum and Historical Society. I'll see you next time.